I used to love the nightlife and hang out in a bar. I used to hit the bottom, but then I hit a car. I'm laid up in a wheelchair, paralyzed for life. Got money through a settlement to see me through the strife. My attitude is different now, the future's not so bleak. I even got a mansion and thrown it for a It's my life, such as it is. My life, such as it is. Such as it is. From the storm, don't touch your points of pity. The hard times never last. Without a leg to stand on, I still manage to kick ass. It's my life, such as it is. My life, such as it is. Such as it is. Paralyzed. Nothing gives a man an appetite like being wealthy. Just water for me. I ate like a horse yesterday. An entire piece of Melba toast. I must have gained three ounces. Ah, excellent. The morning paper. Hmm. Earthquakes, an assassination, nuclear plant accident. Let's get to something that matters. Ah, here it is. Listen to this. Socialite Candy Stuffington poses with an unnamed sickly child. What a crock! Last week it was Taffy Turnbull and those bratty Romanian orphans. The week before it was Bunny Hampton and, I don't know, some kind of retards. You can't truly be someone without attaching your name to something senseless and tragic. Of course, it would help if you... Anything for you, my twig. You could get an incurable disease and die! Very dramatic. Unfortunately, I'm as healthy as a nut-brown gelding. I need my own charity for something really vile and loathsome. Unfortunately, all the good diseases are taken. Heart disease, diabetes, they were snapped up years ago. Some lucky bitch has had cancer for God knows how long. Well, they're classics. They never go out of style. Relax, dear. We'll find you a disease. Well, we've got it narrowed down to chapped lips or prickly heat. With all the money we pay in taxes, they can't come up with a few new diseases for us. What is this country coming to? I'm sure one day you'll get your own tumor. I need to champion people so pathetic and desperate they make your stomach churn. But where to find them? Good morning, neighbor. I brought you a little pie. Yummy. But uh, what's in the box? I'm going to have a telethon to raise money for poor unfortunate souls. Would you be interested in helping? You're talking to the wrong head, lady. Not interested. Now, if you don't mind, you're blocking my light. It pays handsomely. What I meant was, uh, tell me more. All you have to do is be your usual pathetic worthless self for a tidy $500 fee. Keep tidying. One thousand. Hey, do I look like a cheap whore to you? Five grand. Three thousand. Another one thousand if you can deliver your crippled roommates. I tell you what, next time you take a bath, leave the blinds open. <laughs> you disgust me. Hey, I disgust me. Is it a deal? It's a deal. <laughs> My differently able chums. I rented a video that's sure to make you feel better about your own lives. Real life death. Oh. oh. Hi, Gabby. Blazer, what a pleasant surprise. I'm not scheduled to see you and your friends till next week. Ever wonder what it's like to be gored by a bull? This is kind of last minute. Um, I need your help. You're reaching out to me. This is a real breakthrough. <gasps> oh, I feel so close to you. Then can I have a pair of your workout shorts? <laughs> Let's not start that again, okay? Okay, okay. Um, I've been thinking how lucky I am. Sure, I might not have limbs or internal organs, but I have a roof over my head and friends who love me. Yes, you're a very lucky head. I want to help those less fortunate than me. I want to give something back. 
How commendable. We could gather up some old clothes. Or there's a telethon for the Save the Gimp Foundation. Maybe if I appeared on it, we could raise some money. That's a wonderful idea. Hey, I know. What if all the guys came on? Riley, Lefty, Fontaine. That would be... No, I couldn't ask them. For some reason, they don't trust me. Besides, I don't want them to see this side of me. The tender blazer nobody knows. I suppose I could... You mean you'll ask them? Great! And you're right. Let's not mention that I came down here today. I must say, you've got a big heart for a guy who doesn't have one. Thanks, Debbie. Oh, uh, one last thing. Can I watch you go to the bathroom? Boy, this is tougher than I thought. It's dark, I'm paralyzed, and I don't know what I'm doing. At least the carburetor's all fixed, cleaned up, and purring like a kitty. Well, look who's here. Debbie Golden, a treat to the old, old factory. I have a favor to ask. <laughs> Me too. Mine is, don't ask. It's inspiring the way you help each other, like fixing Franny's car. What if you could help people less fortunate than yourselves? Where are we going to find people less fortunate than ourselves? Nah, nah, Riley, we're blessed. A hundred years ago, if I lost my sight, I'd still be blind. Uh, who wants to tell him he is still blind? How would you feel about appearing on a telethon to help raise money? And we get to keep this money? No, your reward is the satisfaction you'd be getting from helping other people. When did you start smoking crack? I would, but I'm just not comfortable flaunting my hooks in front of a television audience. Blazer? Hey, you know me, Mr. Easy Going. I'll do whatever you guys say. <laughs> A great impression, Lefty. That sounded just like Blazer, except it was nice. Come on, even Liz Bromberg is donating her time. Consider it part of your therapy. Pretty please with the Cheerio Top. Okay, okay, we'll do it. Can we just get back to work? Franny said if we give her van a lube job, she'd give me one. Thank you, gentlemen. You'll be glad. A touch more hairspray, please. Ah, the smell of the grease paint, the roar of the crowd. Neighbors, come in. So good to see you. I'd like to introduce you to some friends of mine. Candy, Taffy, Veronica. These are my cripples. This is Boss Cripple, Old Black Blind Guy, Hook Hands, and Little Head on a Skateboard. Mm, you really found some miserable specimens. <laughs> yes, they're horrible. Well done. <laughs> Five minutes, people. Oh, my, the show's starting. You can watch in your dressing room. I've got to go. Our own dressing room? Tray chic. <coughs> Hi, guys. What are you doing here? We came to lend our support. Look at this food. Mm, escargot Provençal. Shh, it's starting. Tonight, live, it's the Save the Gimps Telethon with your host, Mickey Blothers. We love the crippled, sniveling and gimpy. Even those who are just a little bit limpy, we can help. That's a great idea. Then send you away so we don't have to see ya. Pathetic, gimpy wretches. We love you. Yes, we do. <laughs> oh, yeah. Thank you. <laughs> Thank you. Yeah. Good evening, folks! Tonight, you'll see the most maimed and most disfigured human beings it's been my good fortune to come across. They'll tug at your heartstrings and yank at your purse strings. Gimps, come on down! Look at them, folks! Aren't they? <laughs> 
something. Can you understand me? Can you understand you? You can speak. <laughs> Wonderful. This must be a real treat for you, getting out of the house for a change. Actually, we wanted to stay home today. We were at the beach yesterday. I got sand up my- The beach? Oh, were you evicted from your tiny one-room hovel? Yes. Now we're forced to live in a 30-room mansion. Scrounging through dumpsters for food? I trained at the Cordon Bleu. I prepare most of our meals. High protein, low fat. That sounds terrible. <laughs> We'll be hearing more from these courageous losers later. It's time to check the tally board. So far, we've raised... Four dollars! Well, it's a start. But now, the knife-throwing Valentino! <laughs> Whoops! A uh, Valentino is down! Why aren't we raising more money? You hear those phones? No. Exactly. Your stooges aren't very convincing. They're not helpless enough. Look out! Out of my way! Oh, he's as sick as a dog. He ate a ton of that escargot in our dressing room. We don't have any escargot here. Although we did have a terrible snail problem. Ugh. Get a camera over here and get me on the air! <laughs> An urgent development. Poor Lefty has collapsed. We're not sure if he'll pull through till the end of the program. Let's listen in. Oh, oh let me die! Poor oh, devil! <laughs> nice work in there, Lefty. Want to talk about it? These hooks. <laughs> it's extremely difficult to wipe with these hooks. It's difficult to wipe with these hooks. Doesn't that make you think, folks? Uh. Come on, people. Pick up those phones. Give so Lefty can wipe. <laughs> now, how about a little entertainment? While Lefty washes his hooks, four-year-old Marky Smith is going to tap dance! Listen to those phones! People love that heart-wrenching crap. Get your pals to play it up. I'll double what I'm paying you. Music to my ears, doll. <laughs> Lefty has shown us the way, fellas. If we want to raise money for this charity, we gotta sell it. The more pitiful, the better. Fontaine, go that extra mile. Some wax plugs for your ears. Deaf and blind has more oomph than just blind. Lefty, try these. Prosthetic feet? Misery means money. Grizz, slip into this and join us. Nothing says send cash like a hunchback. And you, Riley. Don't even think about it. Okay, okay, you can be our spokesman. Besides, what more could I do to you? I told you they'd be back, folks. And here they are, in all their wretched glory! So, how are you, really? I'll level with you. We have no friends, no money, no food. We had a puppy. It got run over by a lawnmower. We still find little bits of Scrappy all over the yard. The mom put a contract out on my life. My mother married a Republican, and I have a terrible case of pink eye. Oh. Hello? You're only giving how much? Satan's minions will peck out your eyes and feast on your intestines. That's much better. Now, do you mind if I call you sightless Negro fellow? What? We're here to make dreams come true! How can we brighten your sorry life? I always dreamed of one day uh, working a video camera. We could do that, can't we, folks? <laughs>
like I promised. That little cheating punkhead bastard! And he's in this with that she-devil from next door! He put me in a hump! I'm going to fillet his arse! I'm going to slit him open and crap in his ear! Flying off the handle and getting all crazy is no way to deal with this. We need a plan to really make him suffer. Now, folks, a little surprise. A special presentation to the chairwoman of the GIMP Foundation, Mrs. Liz Bromberg! A presentation to me? I'm being honored. Oh. She's good stock. Now, we have to do something about that hairstyle. You're right. She's a slut. Oh, <laughs> you are. You? Mrs. B, we want to thank you for all you've done and present you with this. It's gratifying to lend a hand to these poor, helpless, useless creatures. I spoon feed them and keep their spirits up by reading passages from the Bible and the Kama Sutra. I do what I can. Oh, you're being too modest. She also bathes us, even strips down on the buff and climbs right into the tub. Well, now, I don't know about Sometimes that. she washes us in those musky nether regions. Yeah, you old girls learn it's true what they say about us brothers in the size department, right, Lizzie? <laughs> now, just a moment. She changes our diapers, even the really stinky ones. Look under her fingernails. I'll bet you'll see a little bit of poop. But she wipes my bum with love. No! Stop it! I knew it. So it's true what they say about the brothers. Now you'll pay, you little weasel. But first, I get a drain mine. <laughs> Ladies, this is a terrible misunderstanding. I think we understand perfectly. Oh, Blazer. <laughs> oh, I've had enough of this whole thing. I'm with you, sister. Let's get that big gorilla. There seems to be a minor disturbance backstage. This might be a good time to do another song. Don't you ever shut up. Why, no. I'm a TV host. You devil! <clears throat> Time to shut this thing down! <laughs> oh my! I'm getting aroused. You've always been a troublemaker. I should have done this years ago. <laughs> Huh. I got you. Surprisingly, the telethon brouhaha had an unexpected effect. Viewers, mesmerized by the brawl, pledged staggering amounts to show their appreciation. In all, some $300,000 was raised. That should be our money! Additionally, over $400,000 damage was done. But hell, it's for a good cause. Now the world wants to know. What has happened to these fighting gimps? Attempts to contact them have been unsuccessful, but our Nose for News team is hot on the trail. You're going to have to see them sometime, Blazer. They'll kill me! It's your decision. Stay here as long as you like. You can room with Gus. Maybe they'll let me explain. What? That you betrayed them, lied, and cheated them out of their money? Yeah, that's pretty much it. I just hope they'll understand.
Well, well, look who's back. I'm sorry, fellas. I've been a bad blazer. Don't trust the sneaky little skull. Uh, maybe the little rascal learned his lesson. Let's say we give him another chance. Ask me in a couple of years. Fontaine, I'll never hide your cane again or saw it down an inch at a time every day. Sounds fair. Lefty, no more prank calls to the police telling them you're selling heroin to school kids. I still have nightmares about that jail cell. And Riley, dear sweet Riley. Quit kissing my ass. I can't feel it anyway. I'm begging. If I had a knee, I'd be down on it. And if I could move my foot, it would be up where your ass used to be. You can sleep in the garage until you earn your way back in. Thank you. I promise I've changed. Liz, you can't keep punishing yourself like this. It's okay. Even the hundred thousand in damages we're liable for? Oi. What now? Look who's out the front. Our viewers want more GIMP wrestling! Apparently our theatrical debut struck a nerve with the viewers. We will never stoop to wrestling on TV. Bravo! We will not be exploited to satiate the bloodlust of an uncaring public. I don't care squat about that, but it sounds like work, and you know how I feel about work. It's time to put all this behind us. Let the healing process begin. You might be right. Let me handle this. I just told him there was one person who deserved all the credit. Liz Bromberg, society's vomit volcano, responsible for a for a failed gimpathon. <laughs> Classic. Mm -hmm.